Uh, this photograph in our collection by Robert Maplethorpe is from 1988. It's, in, it's taken from the latter decade of his life when he was suffering from AIDS. Still Life So are definitely a departure from what Robert Maplethorpe is typically known for, which would be BDSM, subcultures, hyperhuman sexuality, a lot of nudes. Um, but landscape or but still lifes are actually more indicative of his journey through AIDS because they were easier for him to work. He could set them up in his studio. He could work throughout the day without having to worry about a model or someone else's schedule. And so still lifes became a therapeutic way for him to continue to work through his illness.